How is silicon carbide SIC chip made? Generally speaking, chips are semi-finished products that have been cut from wafers. Each wafer integrates hundreds of chips, and each chip consists of thousands of cells. So how to make a cell? First step, injection mask. The wafer is cleaned at first. A layer of silicon oxide film is deposited, and then a photoresist pattern is formed through uniform glue, exposure, development, Finally, the pattern is transferred to the etching mask through an etching process. Second step, iron implantation. Put the masked wafer into an iron implanter and implant high-energy irons. Then, the mask is removed and annealed to activate the implanted irons. Third step, making the grid. A gate oxide layer and a gate electrode layer are sequentially deposited on the wafer to form a gate-level control structure. Fourth step, making a passivation layer. A dielectric layer with good insulating properties is deposited to prevent breakdown between electrodes. Fifth step, making drain source electrodes. Holes are opened on the passivation layer and metal is bartered to form drain source electrodes. When a positive voltage is applied between the drain source electrode and the gate source electrode, the channel opens Electrons flow from the source to the drain, and a current flows from the drain to the source. A basic power device, a cell, has been fabricated. SIC chips can effectively improve work efficiency, reduce energy loss, reduce carbon emissions, improve system reliability, reduce volume, and save space.